Good morning. Today's debate is taking place on the Kid Nation campus, live from the Nose Hair Memorial Museum. <laughs> I'm Nick Adams, and welcome to the first Kid Nation debate. Uh-huh. This debate and others to follow in the next several months are sponsored by the National Corn Growers Association. Eat some corn! Definitely. Now, let's meet our candidates. First, Big Al Mac. Hello. Kelly Raspberry. Hey. JC Chavez. ¿Cómo están mis Latinos? Oh, you suck up. And what? Pandering. And Jenna Owens. Yo. Okay, the debate rules are simple. All right. Each candidate will be asked one question and given 45 seconds to make their point. Oh, oh. God, 45. Okay. That's a lot of time. You don't, uh, you don't have to use it all, though. Yeah. Another pre selected candidate will have 20 seconds to argue their viewpoint on the topic. <sighs> My stomach hurts. That's a lot. Then, the first candidate has 20 seconds. Come back again? Yes. Oh my gosh. And then we move on. Like real? We did a coin toss backstage. A four headed coin or something? Four sided coin? And Big Alice first. Ah! Of course. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah! All right. Okay, Al. All right, here I am. Big Al. Yes. Do we got. uh, Yes, yes, yes. As an owner of a restaurant, and one who has put on a few pounds over the years, you are our resident food expert. Oh, 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 what the hell is that supposed to mean? Wow. That's, oh, uh, you're supposed to be... Uh, neutral. Uh, neutral, yeah. He's just reading the question. Candidate, stay not, calm, please. Not moderate. Okay, sorry, sorry. Yeah. Go ahead. One of your favorite things to eat is a bag of Cheetos. In your expert opinion, is a Cheeto a chip or a snack? Oh, you have 45 seconds. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. You know, it is like this question was custom designed for me because I just happen to have some examples oh, here. Props. I got props. Now, can I have the lays? Sure. There is absolutely no question, no question whatsoever, no argument whatsoever. A Cheeto is not a potato chip. A Frito corn chip, as mm. it plainly says here on the label, is a corn, is a chip. Lay's potato chips. Mm-hmm. A Cheeto is just cheese, a cheese-flavored snack. It's a snack, y'all. It's that simple. That's it. <laughs> a chip. No. Well, yeah. See, I told you I wasn't good. A chip is one of two things. A chip is a thin slice of a potato, usually. Or a chip could be Time's a- up. Thank you, Al. What about that <laughs> Kelly Raspberry, you have 20 seconds to respond. Give me the Cheetos. Here. You got this Obviously, smell. this is a member of a chip family. Yes. Obviously, it is in the chip aisle at the store. It is not made with real cheese, or else you would find it in the dairy department. But no, Cheetos is definitely a member of the chi- chip family as categorized by the shelf stockers. Thank you, wow. Kelly. Wow. It's Didn't wild. even use her whole 20 strong seconds. Strong argument oh, by I, Kelly Raspberry. It Rasberry is part of the chip there. grab bag. Big Al, you now have 20 seconds to respond. Quite simple. If it don't dip, it ain't a chip. Oh, the man. You can dip it. Ah, no, you cannot. You can dip it. It doesn't catch on. Candidates, calm, please. Candidates. Anything. It doesn't make anything a chip. Candidates. Kelly Raspberry. On farm. <laughs> she put a big old potato chip in her mouth. In a recent discussion about what teens consider cool, you made a very controversial stance against Adidas. Oh. What is another fashion choice you see the next generation doing that you think they should discontinue? You have 45 seconds. Well, let me pull up the BuzzFeed article. Discontinue the choker necklaces because when I look at you, it makes me uncomfortable. I can't even breathe. Mm. That is so restrictive. And and when you make me uncomfortable, you're now violating my rights as a citizen. Dang right. So give up the choker necklaces, number one. Number two, give up them booty bear and shorts. I went to dinner the other night with a girl who was might have been wear, well have been wearing denim underwear. There were no shorts to be seen. Mm. A blouse mm. where I can't even see any material sticking out from underneath. Wear your underwear in public. No, that's illegal. Thank you. <laughs> Let's move to candidate Owens. You have turn, 20 yeah. seconds to respond. Uh-oh. As someone that's currently wearing both booty bearing, high-waisted <laughs> jean shorts, and a choker necklace, I'm... <laughs> I am sorry that makes you uncomfortable. I am comfortable. Fashion trends come and go. The more concerning trend here is dad bod. That comes and doesn't go. When I hear young men reasoning with themselves about their baby beer gut being cool because Leonardo DiCaprio has this so-called dad bod. Thank you. Guess what? Leo's going to win an Oscar. Thank you. Yeah. Get rid of the dad bod. Kelly, 20 seconds. Jenna, you are 31 years old. (laughs) That's the end of my argument. Oh, well, Thank, you. Uh, uh, Thank you, uh, candidates. Thank man. you. If you're just joining us, you're listening to the very first Kid Nation debate. Uh-huh. Moving on. Jenna, 
According to EmojiTracker.com, the face with tears of joy emoji is the most used on Twitter with over 854 million documented impressions. Do you think the face with tears of joy emoji should be the most popular? If not, which emoji do you think should be number one? You have 45 seconds. Absolutely not. The tears of joy emoji should not be number one because no one is that funny. Ooh. I laugh to tears maybe three to five times a year. This might be controversial, but I think the black high five should be number one. Mm. Shout out. It is for me, not just because of my spray tan. I think that in order for humanity to show how not racist we are, we need to utilize the black high five more often. This way, when your friends say something funny or just agrees to meet up with you, give you good news, you throw up the black high five, and that's saying, hey, I'm a regular supportive, encouraging high five, but I have dark skin to show just how accepting I am and how far we've come as a society. Wow. Very, mm. that's Some deep. of my best emojis are black. Yeah. <laughs> That is true. That is Thank true. You, Jenna. Uh, candidate Chavez, you have 20 seconds to respond. Thank you. First, I would like to thank you for that question and Jenna for competing against me. But I personally think that the poop emoji should be the most popular. Oh. Why? Because it helps America. The emoji helps kids stop cursing. Instead of texting the S word, they text the Q emoji. And it's beneficial to our economy because it makes money. Are there any face with uh, tears emoji masks or costumes? No. Thank you. Because I just saw poop Time emoji Halloween costumes Please everywhere. Stop. Time is up. Thank you. Jenna, 20 seconds to respond. Well, for someone that only goes to the bathroom twice a year, I have no use for the poop emoji. And Ooh. JC, I would Ooh. just like to point out that my opponent is showing how clearly racist he is by not supporting the use of the black high five. Mm -hmm. May I retort just for one one sentence, please? Nope. No, Rules no. of the debate. Jenna has nope. purchased poop emojis. You, I saw her. Thank you, JC. <laughs> she purchased the masks. Thank you. Moving on to our final question, JC. According to Nielsen, in 2013, U.S. homes received an average of 189.1 TV channels, mm. but viewed only 17.5 of those channels. Which TV channels should cable companies remove from their program guides, and what type of channels should be added? Again, thank you, have you 45 so much. seconds. Thank you so much for this platform to talk about this controversial topic. If you're a channel that does not give me adequate HD, get off. Get off my channel. Because if I see that a cool movie is on and I'm excited to watch it and I turn it on and there's no HD to go along with it, I am devastated. It has ruined my day. Also, if your name is Music Television, play dang music. Get off my, get off my catalog. If you're a Discovery Channel, I'm not discovering anything. Instead, I'm learning about people and building houses. That's not adequate to discovering stuff. Get off my catalog. Oh my god. You Thank still you. have some time. I don't care. <laughs> okay. You get my drift. Thank you. Uh, candidate Mac, oh. 20 seconds to respond. This is so easy. The country, this great country that we live in, this is the United States of America. The first channel I would eliminate if elected president is WeTV. This ain't France. This is America. <laughs> we have no use for WeTV in French. Second one I would get rid of with all of the bombing and terrorism we have going head. on. Stop by your head. We was good. We is TNT. We don't need a network for TNT. Oh my God. Say you should have uh, your head. Yeah. Uh, Candidate Chavez, 20 seconds. I agree with the WeTV. <laughs> this is America. <laughs> Just say, same. Same. <laughs> <laughs>